This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Well, Draymond Green, <laughs> does the A-Town stomp on DeMontas Sabanis' chest? He's caved in from his blows to the chest. Now, this guy, uh, DeMontas, did grab Draymond uh, Green's leg, okay? As you can clearly see, he's grabbing his leg. Now, now he could have gotten injured. I think these players, obviously, we do not think. We know these players are trying to injure each other, right? Because if if uh, Draymond got injured in the game, it gives him an, you know, an upper hand, right? So, you know, he grabbed his leg, hoping to trip him and injure him. But what he didn't anticipate is Draymond Green sick of having his legs grabbed up and stomped him out. All he did was step on him, really. You know, but the guy, you know, you know how NBA players are now. There's, they're overly, oh! Ouch! You know, like they're on the ground. Oh, look at him crying. Ah, in my chest. <laughs> they always overdo it to get those, you know, the foul and everything. Well, Draymond Green got ejected from this, and he was unapologetic un afterwards. He said, you know what? I stepped on someone. The guy grabbed my feet. Now, Shaq had his back. He said, y'all, you don't grab his feet. That won't happen to you. Stop trying to grab people up. Play the game. Stop trying to overdo it, trying to injure people. Now, people were like, oh, he could have done differently. He's in a competitive sport in the heat of this, of a game. <laughs> you don't have time to be like, you know what? Let me signal to everyone that he's grabbing my leg. You don't think like that. You're competing. Of course, he, of course, this would have been the reaction. 50 Cent said... Uh, Draymond Green, what the hell you do that for? He said, 50, I'm a big stepper. I'm out here stepping on stuff for the playoffs. <laughs> I was sitting there looking like, oh, ish. You know, 50 always has to react to things, right? But <laughs> Draymond Green wasn't playing, man. Uh, I like that Shaq and everybody else back. Now, Black Thought destroys uh, Johnny P, the beat right in front of Benny the Butcher. Benny the Butcher was slaughtered for a second time on the Johnny P track. First, J. Cole, the original feature on that song, destroyed, even some would say dissed, dissed Benny the Butcher on the song talking about fake drug dealers and gangsters. You know, according to Benny the Butcher, he used to flip bricks. <laughs> I like Benny the Butcher's music, but he be poor, you know, them, them pork chops be uh, be lying a little too much sometimes, but uh, he's a good rapper, and I do appreciate the skills that he brings to the game, um, the culture. I would say, you know, and then uh, you know that that boom bap real lyricism is dying. You know, uh, J Cole even talks about that. You know, it's a sport that's dying. You know, it is. It's becoming. We went through this in 2009, 10, 11, kind of got out of it a little bit and then cut right back to it. You know, uh, it's just, it's a shame. You know, uh, rap is evolving and it's losing a skill set. You know, it's kind of coming back sometimes. Like we got people keeping it alive, like Griselda, um, you know, J. Cole, Drake, you could say, uh, Kendrick. Um, you got a couple. You got a couple up and coming rappers. Scarlet, um, you know, Nicki's still in the game. Um, Meek Mill, uh, and you got some more up and up and coming rappers like Simba, people like that that are keeping it alive. You know, and if I didn't name, every, I didn't name everybody. There's still a good, healthy amount, but there's so much washing out. The garbage, you know, the garbage is washing out a lot of that other stuff. Um, they're taking up the air, as Jay Z would say. They're taking up the air for the real ones out here, you know, because it's it's microwave music. It's easy, so they can pump it out more, but they also take up space. But you know, there's nothing you can do about it. But just continue to have great music out there. Hopefully, Fifty and Drake and Fifty Cent puts out some music this year, just to just to keep keep the sport alive you know we guys still got jd kiss dropping projects this year and everything and styles p and that stuff is needed anyways i'll get back to some new fresh news in a minute this is jordan tower with jt news